Hey guys, so we tend to think of the body as systems, like broken up into systems. So there could be like the nervous system, the endocrine system, which is the hormonal system, the digestive system, the lymphatic system. So typically we break these things up into these separate systems for learning purposes because the body is just so incredibly complex that if we didn't break it into these systems, it would be really, really hard to grasp as a whole. So we created those systems in order to, or the breakdown of those different systems in order to learn it. But I, the point I wanna get across is that this the body isn't a bunch of separate systems. It's one big unit and everything impacts everything else. So for example, sleep, is going to impact all of those given systems all together. So you can't isolate systems out, like for example, the digestive system as well. If we eat something that we might not tolerate, it's gonna affect other um, areas of the body, not just the digest digestive tract because everything is connected. So you might eat something and then feel brain fog or your blood sugar might plummet which is actually going to affect your cognitive thinking so the point that i'm trying to get across again is that everything is connected and everything is everything so everything impacts everything else and now the the minus of that or the the kind of the negative portion of that is that you know when one thing goes off it can potentially impact everything else and then the great thing about that is that if you improve one area of your life, say sleep, nutrition, you know, movement, exercise, stuff like that, it can impact all of the, the whole body in a positive way. So, you know, if you're, if you're sleeping well, you're going to perform better physically, um, mentally, you're just going to, you know, you're going to think clearer, you're going to be more productive, all that sort of stuff. So it's going to affect every system, just like nutrition. If you get your, say your digestion on point by eating foods that you tolerate well, you're going to be thinking better. Your body composition is going to improve. Your hormonal profile will most likely improve as well. Um, so I just want you guys to think of the system or the body as one, one whole thing, as opposed to all of these separated systems that act um, independently because they don't. Um, everything acts together. So if you have any questions about that, post them below. Um, hit me up, Facebook, email, Instagram, Snapchat, whatever. And uh, I hope you got something out of this and it, and it kind of got you thinking in that one unit um, mentality. All right, guys, thanks for watching. See ya.